Well, this here is the Tata Punch and this car is proof that if you want a big car experience, then you don't have to spend big bucks. You can get that big SUV experience in a relatively affordable package and a relatively compact package. Now, this car really does uh, look and feel and has the road prints of an SUV. It also has a good amount of space on the inside and it's very solid because it, of course, gets that five-star crash test safe rating, which means that you feel very safe and secure on this car when you're sitting in it with your family. You also get a long list of features and the right comfort on this car is truly exemplary. And all these are the reasons why oh, one lakh customers have bought this car in a relatively uh, you know, short span of time. So in today's video, I'm going to tell you some uh, great things about this car and why you should consider buying it if in the market for a compact SUV, but you don't want to spend a lot of cash. My name is Ashish Masi. If you come to this channel for the first time, please like, share and subscribe. Well, so now I'm inside the cabin of the Tata Punch. And before showing it in tears, let me just show you or make you hear one thing, and that is this. Let's do that one more time because it is a very solid and very assuring kind of sound. Uh, do you think that any other car at this price point in this segment will offer you this kind of uh, safety and this kind of reassurance? Well, I don't think so. You also get solid comfort. These seats are the best in the business when it comes to overall comfort. Uh, the support is very good. The cushioning is excellent and the support, especially for the lower back, is truly exemplary. Uh, you'll also like the functions and the features inside this car. Of course, you get a semi-digital display. You also get automatic headlamps, automatic pipers, cruise control, and an excellent sound system in the form of the Herman stereo, where the sound quality is so good, even from the factory speakers that you don't have to upgrade to anything else. Anyways, now let's jump in the back seat and see how good that really is. Well, so before getting inside the car, let me show you one more feature, which a lot of people don't talk about. And that feature is that the doors at the back open at a nice 90 degree. That's something which a lot of people don't tell you. And uh, the benefit of this, of course, is that getting in and out is a breezy affair because you also get a very wide opening aperture. Now let's jump inside and show you the comfort and the space on offer. Well, so now I'm in the back seat of the Tata Punch and one of the biggest highlights of this car, of course, is the fact that you get an armrest at the back. Now, there aren't too many cars. In fact, there's no other car in this segment and at this price point especially, which offers you an armrest. So that's something very unique about this car. You also get very good and comfortable seats. The cushioning is very good and it's a very good car in terms of comfort because my knee and my hip is at a nice 90 degree, which means I'm sitting over here very comfortably and I can see the road ahead because it's a high set seat. And of course, uh, the best point is that the forebody is flat. So whoever's sitting in the middle has plenty of place to stretch his feet. It's also a wide car. No problem in terms of headroom, knee room or overall width. Double thumbs up to the Tata Punch. Now enough from my side. Let's listen to a few customers and a few viewers what they think about the Tata Punch and how they like it and what features they appreciate of this car. Hello everyone. My name is Chatej Kansal. I'm a Delhiite. I have recently purchased a Tata Punch almost 20 days ago. Hello friends, my name is Mohammad Sami and I am a proud owner of Tata Punch and I am using it since last few months and I would say that uh, I love everything about this car. The ground clearance, the fuel economy, the road presence, the space within the car and the interior. And let me tell you, it gives a very soothing driving experience. Recently I travelled to Amritsar drove almost uh, 900 to 1000 kilometers and the driving experience was awesome. If you talk about mileage, it has a great mileage of somewhere around 18 to 19 on highways and almost 14 in the city. And I would say the leg space at the back seats are very good. I think that is best in the class and the seat comforts, I would say it's really good. You won't feel tired even after long drives. I think in comparison to the other cars which are there in this particular segment, it's kind of a best car. Uh, I like it very much. My kids like it very much. It's a complete family car. Well, so you've seen that this car is good to look at. It's got a lot of features. It's solidly built. Uh, but why has it become the choice of one lakh uh, owners so fast? And uh, why is it flying off the shelves? Well, it's not only in all those things, but also because of the way it drives. Yes. Uh, the driving bits of this car truly are exemplary. When uh, it's the first time that you take the uh, Tata Punch out for a drive, you really have to pinch yourself and ask yourself whether you're actually uh, driving a compact car or a car which has a compact wheelbase because uh, this car's 
ride comfort can really out rival some very posh and expensive cars maybe twice or thrice its price it is that good it just uh, smashes out all those badly pasted roads those potholes those crevices the expansion joints everything is taken care of uh, and the suspension on the Tata Punch really works very well absolutely flawlessly it doesn't make any kind of noises in fact uh, it feels like this car is uh, riding on a cloud uh, carpet that's the kind of uh, ride comfort it gives especially considering the segment it is in it really is truly exemplary <laughs> Well, apart from the excellent ride, what you'll also enjoy about this car is the excellent road manners. Yes, uh, the high speed stability of this car is truly very good and gives you a sense of great confidence. When you're on the highway and doing speeds in excess of 100 kph, this car and the suspension feels very solid and very sturdy. And also, apart from the highway, if you're driving up the hills like I am today, you'll really enjoy the road manners of the car and the overall agility that it has to offer. This the steering wheel is very crisp, very direct and offers you very good communication and the body roll also is always under control. Uh, the grip level from the tyres is excellent and the braking ability of the Tata Punch is also something which is very commendable. So all these things make it a very good car uh, for driving. The clutch action and the gearbox action also is very light on the annual version so that also uh, means that you don't feel tired at the end of a long day well but if you are someone who doesn't want to drive the annual and you want to drive the automatic i have good news for you the amt version the automatic version of the car also is pretty good and uh, the gears shift both up as well as down without any hassles whatsoever but the best point about this car is the fact that uh, for first time buyers or first time drivers who've just you know learned how to drive and who are still learning how to drive the best point about this car is the fact that visibility all across is excellent. You get excellent visibility from uh, the A pillar over here. The side view mirrors are large and chunky and you can easily see all the bonnet line. Even the edges of the bonnet are visible and from this mirror even the edge at the back is visible. So you have a good idea about where this car is compared to other motors on the road and also a good idea in case you want to park it into a tight uh, parking slot below your home. One thing which very few people talk about is the cabin isolation. Yes, this cabin feels very well cocooned from the world outside. Uh, you just get a sense of being in your own oyster, in your own world. And the engine, talking about it, the performance of the engine also is quite good. Uh, it's a 1.2 litre petrol. And I have to say that it's a very quick responding engine. It's a rev happy engine. And it's an engine which will never let you down because it's also very well powered. Yes, uh, be it the city use or be it highway use, the engine power is quite good. Well, so in summary, what I'm trying to say is that if in the market uh, with this kind of budget and you want a car which stands out from a sea of other cars out there on the road, other SUVs, other hatchbacks, other crossovers, uh, at this price point, the Tata Punch makes great sense. It's really a great package and uh, truly it's uh, something which over one like customers have already experienced. And I think if you're in the market with this kind of uh, budget, then try out the Tata Punch and I'm sure you will not be disappointed. So guys, if you've enjoyed watching this video, please give us a like. If you have seen it till the end, please subscribe to this channel. And as I said, do check out the Tata Punch at a dealership near you. So bye for now and thanks so much for watching this video.